Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. There's a question that how can we attain the maximum maximum reward during Ramadan for those who are not performing the obligatory fast? La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah. The first is intended. Intended. Because our beloved Prophet وسلم, said that إِذَا مَرِضَ الْعَبْدُ أَوْ سَافَرَ كُتِبَ لَهُ مَا كَانَ يَعْمَلُ صَحِيحًا مُقِيمًا And if a servant of Allah becomes sick or travels, the, the full reward of what they used to do when they were healthy and resident is written for them. And that is from the generosity of Allah and the reality that إِنَّمَا الْأَعْمَالُ بِالنِّيَّاتِ That actions are by their intentions. وَإِنَّمَا لِكُلِّ مْرِئٍ مَا نَوَى And each servant shall have all that they intended. And that is amazing. So you're not able to fast. Make the intention every single day. Ya Rabb, had I been able to fast, I would have. And be genuine in that intention. You are not losing out anything whatsoever of the reward in the Akhirah and the spiritual benefit in this life. Right. And Al-Kareem la tatakhattahu al-amal, the most generous, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, even the highest of hopes do not exceed his absolute generosity, subhanahu wa ta'ala. So that's the, the most important thing. Intend Ramadan, intend to fast, even when you're not able to. Secondly, everything that you are able to do of the works of Ramadan, do them. The best of the works of Ramadan are your obligations, your obligatory prayer, your obligatory charity, and from the obligations, of the most important obligations is leaving the haram, right? leaving the haram. So everything that someone who was able to fast can be done by the one not able to fast. And if they're not able to do it, then we should intend it bi'idnihi subhanahu wa ta'ala. And it's always important to remind ourselves of, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us to look at, unzur, to look at, to reflect upon, athari rahmati rabbik, the traces of Allah's mercy. And there's the tangible traces, which is the tangible creation, hadha khalqullah. But also to look at the subtle traces of Allah's mercy around us, but also in His, in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's guidance. Right. أوجب عليك وجود خدمته وما أوجب عليك إلا دخول جنته Allah Most High has made it incumbent upon you to be devoted to Him. Though in reality He has only made paradise incumbent upon you. Subhanahu wa ta'ala. Walhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah.